you know, for me, one of the things that I've been focusing on lately is happiness. And that my happiness really, it really doesn't have anything to do with the challenges that are coming, the unexpected challenges that may, you know, come up tonight. It doesn't really have to, anything to do with my happiness. Like, I know where my happiness comes from. It comes from inside. But I have so much peace within knowing that right or wrong, good or bad, I get to control what makes me happy. And I can be happy in the worst of situations externally because I get to choose happiness. So if we have this choice in life of being miserable or being happy, of course we would choose happy. But do your actions prove that choice? Do the things that you're doing on a daily basis lead you to that happiness? And so, you know, it's, it's simple to sit up here and say happiness is a choice, so be happy. Well, it's a far more complex process um, than that. And then another thing that Gary Vee always talks about is, you know, the fact that like if you're making $100,000 now doing something you don't like, but you could go make $60,000 doing something you like, it all comes down to your happiness and fulfillment, right? Like it, it may make more sense for you to make way less money, but be happy in what you're doing on a daily basis. My focus is on happiness mm -hmm. because I know a lot of people that make 75 grand a year and they have tons of time off and they spend an incredible amount of time with their family and they're at, they're coaching every league that their yeah, kids are yeah, in yeah. and they're extremely happy. And I know a ton of wealthy, wealthy, wealthy people that are miserable. Mm -hmm. And so I think it's figuring out what, scenario that you can put your yourself in what lifestyle you can put yourself in that's ultimately going to make you happy if you think about how much time we spend in our careers it's like a third of your day which ultimately ends up being a third of your life is it worth doing something that you don't like doing just for a little bit of extra money at the end of the month it doesn't matter how old you are mm -hmm. it doesn't matter your circumstances Life is too short to do something you hate. But I think there's a lot of people out there that are chasing after a dollar amount that could be way happier, yeah. slowing down a little mm -hmm. bit and realizing that, hey, I don't, I don't really need that to be happy. I really like want to spend time with my family. Success is not the key to happiness. Happiness is the key to success. I think it's the only important thing mm -hmm. is figuring out what actually makes you happy yeah. and then building the lifestyle and figuring out the monetary side of what it takes to get that lifestyle yeah. where you're happy. Um, but I think that that comes just with that clarity of understanding what does it look like? What does it feel like? What does it smell like? Like what, what car is it? What house is it? What area of town, like getting super, super specific mm -hmm. uh, on all those things. And the reality is, in life, like there's ups and downs. And every day is not gonna be sunshine and rainbows. But if you can find the happiness in each day, then at the end of the day, when you look back, you can see the positives. You can see the happy moments, the moments that you did enjoy, and not just focus on the day as a whole, which may have been a negative connotation, that you can pinpoint those bright moments in a dark day and it can give you more excitement for the next day, more drive and motivation for the next day.